Hello everybody, this is not a spring chicken. Yes, some news commentators are finally realizing, wait a minute, that the president, when he gets backed into a corner, doubles down? How could oh, yeah, they not realize this? The, the president of the United States well, doubled now, down today, which means when he was in so much trouble over Benghazi, IRS, and all this stuff, he basically, he, he, and I love this, he appoints Susan Rice to be his brand new uh, security advisor and puts the guy that gave her the information, the, the talking points, into another position in the White House. He appoints a person that basically pro-Muslim to be a representative to the, she's pro-Muslim, anti-gun, and wants to sign, the president to sign the treaty that basically turns over our gun control to the, to the Muslim world. Uh, he then basically is appointing a guy to be head of the IRS that basically hates the guts of Republicans. And um, so you don't think, oh, he's also, uh oh, what he, he also, he also flipped off the pre, uh, uh, Bill Clinton. He had an agreement with Bill Clinton. He basically, basically said F you to Bill Clinton now. And no, and no less than, you know, uh, the very liberals have written, writing books about how he's basically, uh, I, I mean, one guy said he has no intention of stepping down. This is just an indication. Oh, uh, oh you know what, what Flea Obama said? He said, don't count on Holder going anywhere, anywhere soon because the president is now realigning his cabinet to have uh, the rule of thumb in my way half my family's views is to keep your enemies close, but to keep your friends close, but your enemies even closer. All of these people have things on the president that they could blow the whistle on him. So they're now all becoming tighter to him. And Obama pressures Congress to prevent a student loan rate increase. They, they, they passed the rule to deal it. What Obama wants actually is the loans forgiven. He wants it tied to his version of what the economy is, which this morning, I love that. This morning, uh, economy is going backwards like everyone knew it was because, oh, what did they say about housing? Well, there was sort of a misunderstanding, which is what happens, is that they were talking about the rises in homes that basically... Uh, they, they were fixer-uppers, are, are needed renovation. The people are doing it and then selling them for current market value, not the value that the original loans were. And the job figure is not good at all. And the, you know, the factory orders, like everyone knew under the universe, but was not being said by the Commerce Department, are a half percent lower than what they said they were going to be. So... Mm -hmm. And DirecTV and two others bid over one million dollars for Hulu. Yeah, well, that's they said that's a disaster because they, Why? Were, they were hoping to get a four or five billion dollar bid. And it said that here, another one from Flea Obama. He said, since Disney, 20th Century Fox, Warner's, all those people are not going to re-up with Hulu. You're buying nothing. They have no, they have no suppliers of material. It's going to be like the the TV land with no program to show on it. Mm -hmm. So in that, so what they're trying to figure out, what idiot would spend a billion dollars to buy an, a, a hole in the ground, which is what Hulu is going to become very shortly. Mm. And commercial human ventures plan for the moon, NASA study. Okay, that co uh, commercial activity could have always been done, but here's one. Okay, and once again, Flea Obama says we we have a law in the United States that for, forbids. Uh, people having guidance systems and rockets for fear that they might use them on something. Mm -hmm. You have to rewrite the law that allows people to do that privately uh, because right now everybody is using military sites to do it from which means the military can watch everything that's being done. They're going to have to build their own facilities to launch from and um, the, the law does not allow that at the moment. And thousands take to streets in Turkey and clash with police. Uh, okay, uh, good one. In, in, instead of showing that the government is so is so religious now, instead of showing the fact that there is massive discontent on violation of the Constitution, they're showing pretty pictures of penguins instead what? of the riots. Anytime they come, pretty to, pictures of are there penguins in Turkey? No, they're just showing pictures oh. of penguins marching every time they get to a riot thing. The government is laughing at the people that have the, the, the dissenters, and they've got. Pe talking penguins instead. <laughs> yeah. But it really, okay, 
It, uh, they said they, they know that the people running the Turkish government now have Obama's advisors because you know what you do to the people in the country that basically say that we have a constitution that says the church shall not be running our country what? and you put the penguins in you basically say F you to you people and they're in the majority which means they're, they're basically getting ready to become an Islamic Republic like other countries and North Korean econ oh. Yes, the North Korean economy surrenders to foreign currency invasion. Yeah, because they're um, they're 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 basically uh, what happens is North Korea does have some things that the okay here it works is they're taking uh, the uh, Saudis, the Chinese, the uh, Russians, the Iranians who do business with it basically are paying them off in American dollars so that the, uh, the, the Koreans will be buying stuff with our own money that Obama basically gave to all of these people. Mm -hmm. And Chinese protest city to release environment report. Yeah, that's never going to happen because you can... Uh, basically, they, they, they did an unbelievable superhuman effort to clean up the air in, in, in Peking, which is now Beijing, for the last Olympic Games, but now basically um, you, I think what they said, you can't see more than a, a half a block in any direction in that huge city anymore. And Chinese poultry slaughterhouse fire kills at least 55. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> there, this is why they're worried about turning over a company you know, like Smith over to the Chinese because they have no regulations. I mean, you're going to be getting stuff from China that can't pass the even the the... Uh, uh, a, a visual inspection in this country and expect people to be buying. Grocery stores aren't going to carry it. You don't think the environmentalists will put a halt to any of that coming into our country? So you've got to destroy. We have to, oh, you know what Herbie Daddy said? This town of Smith is also a Republican area, so the president really doesn't give a rat's ass. And Syrian rebels and Hezbollah in deadly fight in Lebanon. Yeah, Hezbollah is on the site. That Hezbollah is on the, the Syrian government site. Here's what they said. So Assad is now firmly in control of the country again, and you're going to have a civil war that's going to go on for years between the extremists that want to take over the country and Assad. Here's the thing is, why, did, why have the United States kept these dictators in power? Because they're our dictators. What you're now getting in the Middle East is their dictators, and, it's, and our dictators are more benevolent than their dictators. Mm. And uh, fossil remains may contain the world's first bird specimen. Well, we've seen that thing. I mean, we've seen that, that, little, that little block. I mean, I, uh, as you know, the little bee actually had one of those early specimens. I don't know where it's Oh, she did? Out. Yeah. I paid a lot of money for that thing in China, so for her. And man builds working car out of wood. Uh, guess what is in the Mercedes, in the, uh, in, the Rolls Royce, there's a god awful lot of wood parts in it. You've built cars out of wood for since the very beginning, folks. Mm. And man wins $31 million jackpot with identical lottery tickets? Yeah. That's, that's kind of cool. I love that. Basically, one, uh, it's possible. Some guy basically win the same jack. They win the. Okay, what happened? Because they bought identical tickets. He got identical tickets, which meant he got all. He, he didn't lose any of the value, but he. But some people win the lottery that, you know, what happens is when you win the lottery, you tend to win the lottery again. That's how it works. Wow. So it always starts with the first win? Yep. <laughs> I don't know win, how that the happens. The first win tends to lead you to other lottery wins, and it's not by increasing the amount of money you spend because people that win on the lottery continue to invest in the lottery, but they don't invest at any higher rate than they did before. And large asteroid with small moon and tow to fly by Earth. I know. It's going to fly by close enough. Here, we don't worry about being hit like in the movie Asteroid. Well, other than the fact that you're going to be able to see the bloody thing with the naked eye, that's close, folks. It's like moon close. And a Monty bubbleism for the Mark Twain of the animal kingdom. Okay, Here, here's something. When a person has a modus operandi of doing the same thing every time they get in trouble, I cannot understand why people are so amazed when they do the same thing they have a history of doing. Mm.